What's going on everybody? Today we're going to be covering the Noble Tavern inside of Ranhorn. Guys, the Noble Tavern is going to be where you guys do all your summons for your heroes in game. Once you guys click the Noble Tavern, there will be a couple of features on there that will help you guys progress a little bit early that a lot of players overlook. The number one thing is the wish list. The wish list is where you guys can select what heroes out of each faction you would prefer when you get an elite drawing. So I definitely check that out guys. Uh, make sure you guys are pre-selecting the heroes that you guys would like to get from a drawing as some are definitely better than others depending on what time you guys are playing AFK Arena throughout the year. If you guys need an updated list of what heroes to pick on your wish list, we'll be providing that over on our YouTube channel as we continue giving AFK Arena content, okay? So, highly recommend using the wish list. Pre-selecting your five heroes from each faction will definitely help you uh, progress early game so that you guys can get the best heroes for the best lineups to be able to have the best possible matches and outcomes. So hit up that wish list, guys. That'll be your number one thing inside of the Noble Tavern. Now, let's get into drawings. Inside of the Noble Tavern, there are actually three different types of drawings. Uh, the first one is the more common drawing that you're going to be doing as you guys progress through the game. Once you stack a certain amount of diamonds, you'll be able to do a 10 draw. Uh, but you can also stack up 10 scrolls as well and do it that way too. Now, I don't recommend doing one-time drawings. Always do 10 drawings as you get more for your buck. And uh, it tends to be a better uh, outcome when you do a 10 drawing instead of a 1, okay? So, the very first one uh, is your get all types of heroes and uh, it also tells you what kind of uh, percentage you have to get a certain tier so for the main package you can kind of get like common tier heroes for 51% rare tier heroes for 43 elite heroes for 4 and awakened heroes for a 0.10% but make sure you guys are increasing your odds of what hero you want to get by making that wish list like we talked about a second ago okay now moving on to the second type of drawing that's inside of the noble tavern you have a faction drawing these faction drawings happen on a you know a couple hour basis so like every eight hours every 10 hours uh, they rotate to a new faction so this is kind of where you guys are looking for oh I need a, a specific faction to do a specific mission or to clear a certain tower this is where you guys would do it at you know if you're looking for a uh, a specific faction you can kind of uh, switch between which one you want but it will cost you guys diamonds or you can just wait until the timer goes down and it'll rotate itself okay currently it's on an 8 hour and 35 minute timer but if I really wanted to switch a faction I would literally just click the other one and pay for it with my diamonds and it's just as easy as that like I said guys you want to make sure you're still doing your tin draw on that and then you want to make sure uh, if you want to check what the kind of uh, rate is for the type of hero you want for a tier you know currently common is 51 rare is 43 and elite is 4.61 but like i said increase those chances by making that wish list okay moving on to the third drawing guys we have a, uh this one is kind of a cool one I, I like how they implemented this feature uh a lot of this uh features are overlooked by you know newer players so this is where i kind of recommend having a lot of friends inside of the game super easy to do i'll show you guys a quick tip on how to get friends as well but the reason why you want a lot of friends in game is because this drawing goes off of hearts you get hearts just from having friends and sending and receiving hearts uh, every single day and then once you stack up on 100 hearts you can do a 10 summon you can, guys can get any type of hero here as well uh, and then definitely increase those chances off your wish list currently they got a 52 percent uh rate for common a 44 for rare a two percent for elite and a 0.10 percent for uh waken so make sure you guys are utilizing all of these different drawings guys make sure you're utilizing that uh wish list as this is key to progressing in the game as uh, the more heroes you get the more heroes you can ascend you know the uh, earlier and faster you guys can progress in the game now speaking about how we said uh, you can get those hearts for that drawing a super quick tip to get uh, a lot of friends early game is to actually hit the chat you want to go over to global chat over here and then you just want to look for the people that do the add me stickers okay these are people that are you know kind of brand new to the game they're trying to get the, you know their friends up so they can get these hearts uh, and so many more features that we'll cover later on but this is how you do it so basically this person said add me you just click on their profile picture and then you just hit the little on the bottom right you hit the add button you add them and then all you have to do is wait for them to send your friend request back and once they send you that friend request back um, all you do is accept it and then from there you guys can actually send and receive hearts from these little uh, heart symbols on the right side of their uh, character uh, profile so definitely check that out guys stack up on your hearts go inside of the noble tavern do your 100 drawing or your 10 drawing with the 100 hearts to get the best heroes that you guys can so you can you know ascend your heroes early game and progress even faster now speaking of friends another cool feature um, that you guys can do that a lot of players overlook early game is once you have a, uh, any friends you guys can stop by or even if you're in a guild you can stop by the oak inn and actually inside of the oak inn 
Um, once you have a uh, ascended hero, it's pretty cool because you can place them inside of here. But until you get one, and even after you get one, you still want to do this. You can do this as early as you start the game. You're able to go into the Oaken. You want to go in here and you want to make sure you guys are claiming your red chests. Uh, there are red chests that you can get from your friends uh, that are sitting inside of the oak, the oak inn and you can only claim three a day. Now there are other chests you guys can claim is there's a purple one right there going down the elevator. Make sure you guys don't click that one. You want to make sure you go for the red chest, okay? You get three of them a day. You can collect three rewards inside of here a day and those are the most important ones that you guys can get. So definitely uh, take advantage of that guys. Find the heroes with the red chest, click on them and then they give you lots of amazing rewards that uh, you guys can use to progress as well. So. Those are a couple things that I, I wish I would have known starting, and uh, hopefully that helps you guys as well, uh, so that you guys can, you know, progress in the game a little bit earlier and uh, get the heroes that you guys want. Guys, thank you so much for being here today uh, and going through the Noble Tavern with us. We will be covering more AFK Arena content going forward every single day, so definitely tune in if you guys want an updated wish list. That'll be coming soon, and uh, so much more. Guys, as always, take care of yourself, take care of each other, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.